Travis Kulstum found it as Taylor Swift spills the beans on her surprise gift. It was a breezy September afternoon, and Kansas City Chiefs tight end Travis Kulse was winding down after a long day of practice. His upcoming birthday on October 5th was in the back of his mind, but he wasn't expecting anything too wild. That was until his girlfriend, global superstar Taylor Swift, casually dropped by his house with a mischievous glint in her eye. Hey, babe Taylor greeted with her signature smile as she kicked off her boots and slid onto the couch beside him. Hey, you Travis grinned, pulling her clothes for a quick kiss. You seem excited. She shrugged innocently. Maybe. Travis leaned back, trying to shake off the curiosity building in his gut. Taylor always had a way of keeping him on his toes, and as his birthday approached, he knew she was plotting something. But today, she was too calm, too compassed. She was planning something huge. So what's going on? Travis asked casually, playing it cool. Taylor bit her lip, a sign that she was holding back something major. Travis knew her tells by now. Okay, okay she finally burst, unable to contain it any longer. I can't hold it in. I got you the craziest birthday surprise, and I'm dying to tell you. Travis chuckled, leaning in with raised brows. Oh yeah? What is it? Taylor's excitement bubbled over. I've rented out the entire Arrowhead Stadium for a private concert just for you and a few of your closest friends and family. And get this it's not a Taylor Swift concert. Travis blinked, his mind reeling. Wait, what? Not a Taylor Swift concert. Who's performing? Taylor's eyes sparkled. You remember that one time you said it'd be wild to see NSYNC live? Yeah, but that was a joke right? Travis said, still trying to piece it together. Nope, I tracked them down and got them to reunite just for you. Taylor grinned, looking like she might burst with excitement. They're going to perform all their hits. It's going to be epic. Travis stared at her, mouth agape. You did what? You got NSYNC to perform? For my birthday yup. I pulled a few strings Taylor winked, and made it happen. Travis ran a hand through his hair, genuinely dumbfounded. Babe, that's insane. You're serious? Taylor nodded, her smile wide. Dead serious. So, what do you think? Travis sat back shaking his head in disbelief. I don't even know what to say. That's, that's the coolest thing anyone's ever done for me. You're incredible. Taylor laughed, leaning in to kiss his cheek. Happy early birthday, Kels. Just wait until you see their dance moves. As he sat there, still trying to wrap his head around the fact that NSYNC was reuniting for his birthday. Travis couldn't help but feel incredibly lucky. Taylor had a way of outdoing herself and this time, she had truly taken the cake. Well, Travis finally said, now I just have to figure out how to top this next year. Taylor grinned mischievously. Good luck, Travis Kulse was lounging on his couch after a long day of practice, scrolling through his phone. When he heard the unmistakable sound of Taylor Swift's footsteps approaching, his girlfriend, always full of surprises, had been acting particularly secretive over the past few weeks, and it was driving him crazy. With his 35th birthday on October 5th just around the corner, he had a sneaking suspicion she had something special planned. Hey babe, what are you up to? Travis asked, playfully pulling her down onto the couch beside him. Taylor smiled, her eyes twinkling with that mischievous spark Travis adored. Oh, you'll find out soon enough she teased planting a kiss on his cheek. He tried to coax it out of her with his signature charm, but Taylor was as tight-lipped as ever. For weeks, she'd been dodging his attempts to figure out what her surprise was, always leaving him guessing. But today felt different. Taylor was in an unusually giggly mood, and the more they joked around, the more Travis thought he might finally crack her. All right, you've tortured me long enough. I need at least one hint. Travis begged, his hands clasped together in mock desperation. Taylor raised an eyebrow, looking as though she was weighing the pros and cons of keeping up her act. Then, without warning, she blurted out, fine, but I'll just tell you one thing it involves a custom made no way. Travis interrupted, his eyes widening as he leaned in closer. A custom made what Taylor laughed, realizing her mistake. No, I've already said too much. She covered her mouth, but it was too late. The damage was done. Travis, now fully invested, pressed her for more details. 
his excitement growing by the second. Come on, just a little more. You can't leave me hanging like that. Taylor, clearly enjoying the moment, leaned back and sighed dramatically. Well, I wasn't planning on telling you until your birthday, but since I've already spilled the beans Travis's heart raced, he leaned in even closer, hanging on her every word. It's a custom-made tour bus, Taylor said grinning from ear to ear, decked out with all your favorite things Chief's memorabilia, your favorite snacks, a mini gym, everything you could ever want while you're on the road. Travis blinked, completely dumbfounded. A a tour bus? For me. His voice cracked slightly. Taylor nodded, her smile widening. Yep, I figured with all the travel during the season, you'd appreciate having your own space to relax, recharge, and stay connected with home. Travis stared at her in disbelief. That's insane. How did you even I may have pulled a few strings Taylor said with a wink. But hey, you're worth it. For the first time in his life Travis Kels, known for his swagger and quick wit, was at a complete loss for words. He pulled Taylor into a hug, shaking his head in amazement. I don't even know what to say he muttered, still stunned by the sheer thoughtfulness of her gift. You seriously outdid yourself. Taylor laughed softly, resting her head on his shoulder. Happy early birthday, Trav. You deserve title. The big reveal Travis Kels was lounging on his couch, watching a football replay when his phone buzzed. It was a message from his girlfriend, Taylor Swift. She had been acting a little mysterious lately, dropping subtle hints about something special for his upcoming birthday on October 5th. He was curious, but knowing Taylor, he figured it was some thoughtful surprise. Hey, you free for dinner tonight? Taylor's text read, Of course. What's up? Travis replied. His interest peaked. Just got something to share. You'll want to hear this in person. Now Travis was even more intrigued. All day, he couldn't stop thinking about it. Had she planned a concert for him? A trip? Maybe a new song? By the time he arrived at Taylor's house later that evening, his mind was racing with possibilities. Taylor greeted him at the door, her smile radiant as ever. She led him inside, where the dining room was set with candles and flowers. Everything felt special, yet casual, just how they both liked it. After dinner, they sat on the couch with glasses of wine in hand. Travis noticed Taylor fidgeting a bit, clearly excited. Okay, so I know your birthday's coming up, and I've been thinking a lot about what to get you Taylor began. Travis grinned, setting his glass down. You didn't have to get me anything, you know. She shot him a playful glare. Oh, please, you know I love spoiling you. But this time, I wanted to do something extra special. He leaned back, completely relaxed. All right? Swift, spill it. What have you got up your sleeve? Taylor bit her lip, her eyes twinkling. Okay, promise not to freak out? Travis chuckled. I'm Travis Kels, I don't freak out. Lay it on me. Well she paused for dramatic effect. I'm flying your entire family out to Kansas City for a big birthday bash. But that's not all Travis's eyebrows shot up in surprise. He hadn't expected that. No way. That's awesome. Taylor's grin widened. And I'm throwing a private concert for you and your friends just us. Backstage VIP. No crowds. But wait, there's more. Travis's jaw dropped. A private concert? His mind was already blown. This is insane. She leaned in closer, lowering her voice. And I'm debuting a brand new song. A song I wrote just for you. For the first time in a long while, Travis Kels was dumbfounded. He blinked, trying to process everything she had just said. His family, a private concert, and a song for him. I, I don't even know what to say Travis finally stammered, running a hand through his hair. Taylor laughed, clearly enjoying his reaction. You don't have to say anything. Just be ready for the best birthday of your life. Still in disbelief, Travis pulled her into a hug. I can't believe you did all this. You're incredible. She smirked against his chest. I know. As they sat together, Travis couldn't help but shake his head, still dumbfounded by the surprise. Taylor Swift had just set the bar impossibly high for birthday gifts, and for once, the tight end was at a loss for